page. It's weird. I can't seem to go. Oh, hello. Oh, is that? Oh, there? Uh, Gapper. Back, Everyone put a Gapper if we're live. Gap up. Gap up. Very good. Very we're back, boys. It can keep us down. <laughs> And let's all of us celebrate by showing one titty. <laughs> one uh, testy. A single testy. When's the last time you looked at your booze? Um, oh, like, fucking like, well, I guess it was like an hour and a half ago. I was in the shower, having, a, having an old scrub. Why were you looking at them, though? I'm just washing my balls. Do you, do you, you can't look at everything you wash, though. No, but do you never, like, you know, have a little check, you know. Give them like a give them like a stretch around. Um, what the fuck? Have a ball while you're in the shower. Yeah, have a little ball. Just wrap them around your leg. Yeah, I, did, I didn't wash my dick. I didn't wash my dick. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. No. Very <laughs> different. We very, never very do that. Different. None of us ever do that. Um, uh, I put a condom on beforehand so my dick wouldn't get yep. wet. Yeah, that's good. Triple bag, um, drop of water. Triple bag, uh, though. Triple bag, and then like duct tape belt <laughs> around to hold it away. And a padlock. The balls are hanging there. And a padlock, yeah. And by the way, a lot of people have no idea what anatomy is. Dick washer confirmed. Dick washer, your dick isn't your balls. That is your dick true. is not your balls. Can we just get that as a, like a PSA? That is not the same thing. We do need to make sure the plebs understand what, the your difference. Dick, your dick, dick and balls is the same thing. Dom's Very important, his dick. guys. Come on. Come on now. I know, you know, this is all very jolly and lots of japes on this stream, but we we got to get one thing straight. Your dick is not your balls. Okay? Your dick is not your balls. Um, uh, <laughs> yeah, just so, just so you know. Dick. Just so you know. Not equal. Can't balls. wash your dick without... Can't wash your balls without washing your dick a little. No, they had like That's a not system. That's not true. Yeah. You just have to be careful, you know. You got to be so careful. Yeah, you should use like um, a toothbrush to just get all the dirty areas, not yeah, yeah, yeah. on the dick. Are you allowed to wash inside your dick with a toothbrush, or does that count as dick, dick That's washing? dick washing. That's where like okay. the premium content is. <laughs> That's where the OnlyFans is. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, no. oh. No. The outside oh. is the bread and butter. The inside, ooh, ooh. Oh fuck! When that is such draw... a horrible idea. When did you draw the frog? Me and the frog. <laughs> when did that appear? <laughs> when he just oh, noticed yeah. it. Uh, so what I was thinking when we were talking about rebranding you. Yeah. Um, as frog blower six. That's like a. That's is that like a six panel emote <laughs> that people uh, can make? <laughs> yeah. This this could be an emote that we can put for you straight away. There's an emote, right? We'll definitely chop this out. Um, no, I was thinking a bit like you know um, how. Prince has just like a symbol for a name. Oh, well, he uh, didn't. He that he, he didn't. He, he went back to being Prince, and now he's dead. So uh, I don't see any correlation. But uh, we. I'm just a bit worried. <laughs> we change your name just to this. What to emoji? Instead. Emoji frog, and then emoji sucking face. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So what? My first name is a f a frog being blown. And my surname is me blowing a frog. Yeah. Okay. How does that sound? Hi. Oh, Mr. Me blowing a frog. Oh, please. Don't call me Mr. Me blowing a frog. <laughs> call me frog being blown. Uh, can you change your name to being an emoji? Well, it's part of like Unicode now, isn't it? And I imagine that all of the Depot stuff is done online. Should we pull up the form and try and do it? It's probably a delay because of everything going on. Well, yeah, because take so at least three are months. changing their names <laughs> during the coronavirus. <laughs> Everyone's so bored. They're all adding emojis to their names. Um, yeah. Why? I mean, realistically, you know, a picture is worth a thousand words. Boom. So there, there you go. Why? Thousand why not? Thousand word name. Um, yeah. Yeah. Can you do it? Can I Until... change my name to be the entire script for B movie? Uh, but why not just B emoji? Like so much cleaner, simpler, nicer. Yeah. Not B. Um, yeah, I'd be, I'd be into that. 
can we can we do it? 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 He's great. He never gets used unless we specifically <laughs> mention his existence. <laughs> but, but, you know... It's the only time he ever gets used. But then he actually, you know, his yearly usage goes up quite a lot when we mention him. So actually, you know, he sits quite pleasantly on the graphs. Okay. Okay. So he's worth he's worth hanging around. He's worth keeping around, some, yeah. Some emotes to just never, ever even get mentioned, let alone used. When's the last time someone used my meme emote? The Yog meme. You know, what just get rid of fuck? that one. Did you see that highlighted message? What the fuck? What? You stream yourself, this is to me, you stream yourself <laughs> putting makeup on a frog and then store the frog in a container for five months <laughs> until it dies and starts to rot. What the fuck? Who said that? I think they're a serial killer. That is definitely Someone a give them a mod. One sec. Where the... That yeah, serial killer. That's the level of like ruthlessness you want as a mod, surely. Yeah, it's like how um you know like the FBI oh. you know get like the pro hackers from all the dark side of the internet. You know, yeah, you get like a serial killer to be your lead mod. Very cool. The problem is, it's it's much like politics. The people that want to be in charge of things are the exact kind of people that you don't want to be in charge of things. Yeah, that's it. Um... Or the police. If someone wants to be a police officer really, really bad, they should never be a police officer. <laughs> Is that... Or joining the army. Yeah, I really want to just shoot people. It seems like pretty cool to do. You're like, no, maybe... <laughs> maybe you know, not. Maybe you should work in, in traffic. What about instead? a firefighter? Yeah, I really want to put out a fire. Like, you know, well, that's quite good. Thing of, like, most... Like, no, well, they want it too most. bad. They want it too bad. If they want <laughs> to put out fires that badly, there's something fucking wrong with them. No, like loads of firefighters, like the amount of like arsonists that are firefighters is like much yeah. higher than any profession. Oh, what? Because they just love fire. They like being around it. They, they get love horny. Fire. They're like, oh, oh my they god, get hot for fire. Is that why their suits oh, are I so big? I see what you did there. That's good. Yeah, do you That's like good. that? Do you like that? Um, that's my new slogan because they want to become the fire chief of Bristol. Tom Clark is hot for fire. Oh, do you get one uh, of those cool fireman's hats that's like big and white and then they know that you're the um, chief? Oh, I hope so. Oh, that would be so fucking cool. Any job where you get a cool hat. Why do we not have cool hats at the Oxcast? Well, I, I mean, I got a hat. I got a hat one time. That's and, true. And... I look like a jackass. <laughs> no, I look, like that I wasn't, hat. I wasn't even in, insulting your hat. I was just like, oh, that looks like the hat from King of the Hill, which is like a cartoon. And you took Are you Hank saying Hill. cartoons aren't real? Hank Hill negs the hat, and that made you stop wearing the hat. Why did I mean, you that is bring exactly the hat back? Happened, yeah. Have you got the hat on you? Where bring is the it? hat back. I think it suited you. Can you take take a picture of yourself in the hat right now? The hat's in the office, yeah, so in the office. that's not going to happen. Why have you left it in the office? That's it's not your, gonna it's your hat. Happen. You need it. Why do you leave it? Happen. Oh, my God. I do have... Maybe I could put this on. Hang on. Let me just... Let me just put this... Is that your first suit? Oh, God, what hear. do I even look like? I'm... <laughs> do I look quite rough? <laughs> I really hope like... there's a frog in the background of this. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let me just tweet tweet this. Yep. Okay, there we go. I didn't. I haven't been tweeting that we've been going live at all. Okay, this, this will be all right. Okay, what do you think of my hat? That's nice. It's nice. It's like I'm. That's what judges put on when they sentence someone to be executed. What? Jesus. You do look like a judge, actually. Not like the Judge Dread, just like a, you know. Hello. Uh, okay, that's a nice hat, Simon. Very. You're cool. looking great. You're looking great, Simon. Thanks. Thanks, man. What is that? Oh, what it's is... it's a cloth that, I, that came with my MSI laptop that goes over the, like the the keyboard, stops oh. dust on it, and then yeah, it's nice. Quite a nice little cloth. Used to clean my glasses sometimes. 
Yeah, is that all the cloth does? Everyone needs a little uh, cloth now and again. Yeah. Yeah. It's a nice little cloth for you. What are you doing? Why am I? <laughs> I like that I'm picture, scared. Simon. He um... looks scared and so afraid. You paint. You have to paint the rest of my head and then a hat on top of it. Well, I was gonna. Um... <laughs> you, can't, you, you can't resize. That's you can't resize hat. though. That's, That's literally that such a Simon big hat. hat. <laughs> Is that it? One for one. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't <laughs> resize it in this program. It's not smart enough to do that. Um... Can you at least put it on? Put it on me. Put me under it. <coughs> I need to get a smaller hat. We need oh. a smaller hat. That was like exactly the same hat, though. Yeah. How I did remember. you find? That's not the same hat. That is. That's a <laughs> what they called the filthy bag. I like it. It's too no, small. The... That was good. Yeah. Too... <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna fucking Goldilocks until we. What get were they called? Hat. The Peaky, Peaky blinders. blinders. Peaky Blinders. That's it. Not not filthy bangers. Dude, um, that, the, those hats were exactly the fucking same. Just one was blue and one was. Green. Those were the same hat. I'm pretty sure. Look, colour's very important, okay? Okay, maybe it'll be easier just to find a bigger picture of Simon. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be nice. Yeah, yeah that'd be lovely. You we know, got some I'm donations, Simon, if you want to uh, read them. You want to read some donations? Oh, yes. Uh, Suro nice. the Death got in there early with his dono. Hello, Yogscast! How you doing? I miss your pro gameplay! I have seen the new episode move of the ReZero Frozen Bound really good. If you like the ReZero anime, I would recommend this episode. It's one hour and 16 minutes long, so ye may it count as a movie. What the fuck? What, what the fuck? What was that? ReZero Frozen Bound. Three zero frozen bound. Has anyone zero heard of frozen bound? I, I have no idea. Absolutely zero idea what you're talking about. Sounds suspiciously like anime to me. I don't know. We do not watch anime here. We fucking. Let's fucking. Whoa, 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 whoa. Three zero frozen bound. Frozen bond. Uh, Muli Wap has donated a, a semi desi. No, a desi hundo. Ten bucks. Oh, thank you. Hey there, chili boys. Hope you're doing great. Barry is ho. Pretty rude. Pretty fucking rude. Me. What a ho. Uh, Mozu has donated a semi desi hundo. Thanks you, Simone, for making the Yogs casticles. You beautiful boy. Harry and Blom are pretty cool too. Oh, that's the Blob. Blom. Has anyone ever called you Blom before? My name is Blom. I'm Barbin. 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 I'm Barbin. Adding a Barbin B to blame. words just makes them just infinitely more fun. It makes them botch better. Botch better. Butch better. <laughs> oh, look, it's Simon Lane. <laughs> what is he doing now, do you reckon? Do you reckon we can find I him? I wonder what his net him? worth is these days. <laughs> wow. Are oh. you like, going to gain flex on him and say that yours is more? No. Jesus, I've looked up this thing Suro talked about, and it is pure weebanism. It's what pretty it? disgusting. Cold. Frozen Bond. Frozen Bond. Okay, so. It is uh... disgusting. With 12 bucks 51 Is that £10? Oh, good exchange know. rate. Gee, really? Hi, Chili Boys. I've decided to donate under my real name from now on, as no one can pronounce my weird username, <laughs> Loretta. 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 Exactly. L'Oreal. Hopefully there are no other Lois. Is it Lewis or Lois? Oh my god, this, is, this name is even more confusing. <laughs> ah! Lois, that can watch and donate to the stream, lol. How is isolation going for you guys? Well, it could be, could be worse, I suppose. Could be worse. Yeah, it could, could be, be worse. Yeah. Um, I, t I feel like Lois is more confusing than Laurietta. Lou. Louis. Is it Louise? Is it Lois? Is it Lois? Louise has an extra U in it, doesn't it? 
Um, oh, I don't know. It's like Louis. Hey, Louis. Uh, like French. Ah, Louis. Ah, Louis. Ah, bon Louis. It, it, it's Lois. Okay. Lois. Were we right with Laurietta? Laurietta feels right. I have no idea uh, how you pronounce Loretta. it. Laurentia. Is that what I said before? <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Oh, no, we're okay. Lois. Thank you, Lois. Lois. And we got a uh, our, our piss guy is donated a semi oh, right. hando. Piss guy. That's Woodrow Wilsonson. Finally got my Chiluminati hoodie. Wow. Just awesome. in time for the summer. Oh. Uh, <laughs> tried Yog Coffee too. It is especially average. We'll just Ooh. donate here next time. I remain piss guy. Stunning reviews. Oh. There you go. Stunning can we add reviews. That to, can we add that to the store page? Uh, what was it? Stunningly average. Especially average. Our Especially piss guy. average. Are you doing much piss experimenting, Woodrow Wilson, right now? I feel like it must be, you know, a busy time for piss. You know, with all the all the lockdown and the science that's going on. They're probably analysing, you know, a lot of piss. A lot of piss. Um... Maybe the piss is backed up and there's like, you know, there's months worth of piss that's just building up. Oh my god. Does piss go off? Does piss rot? Uh, if only it, we had someone that could <laughs> answer it does these, go, it does these go questions, bad, doesn't it? Because you, if you if you drink piss, it's fine to drink it fresh, right? But if you, I thought it was bad like, to drink piss full stop, isn't it? No, like immediately, it's fine. But you leave it like, um, <laughs> who told like you this story? <laughs> uh, and it gets really, then it goes really super toxic. Oh, it becomes ammonia, doesn't it? Something like that. Which is bad. Um, Isn't that um, one of your five a day? I thought ammonia was like one of the helpful boys. Is that I bad? think the problem with ammonia is that if you add bleach to it, it releases chlorine. So oh. if piss goes off, if you then try and clean it with bleach, it will release chlorine gas and it will gas you. That's not what you want. So the only way to get rid of toxic piss is to just drink it up as quick as you can. Just gobble it. Nom, um, nom, 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 nom. Is that right? Piss guy will let us know. Um, Piss guy, let us know. Um, we got their message. Uh, a donor of uh, three fifty-five from Sasha Cole's web. That's their whole name. It's a good name. That's Strong name. name. <sighs> was drinking oh. last night and ended up on Pedguin stream. Wait, was it? Um, was the piss fresh or was it old piss? <laughs> we need to know, Which Sasha. <laughs> you have to tell us. Well, they were drinking. It was. Oh, I think I just assumed he was drinking like. Lager beer or some something. So fresh. Oh, piss. oh! I thought they like were adding <laughs> in at this stage because they knew about the piss conversation and um, uh, yeah, they were they were saying that they were drinking piss too. They drank so much piss they blacked out. I am interested. If any of our oh listeners God. or watchers have, have ever drunk piss, please do write in and tell us why and how. I want to hear. I want to hear about these stories. So I've never done it, and I'm so interested. Can you like private message Barry that? No, no, yeah. donate Private it in so Simon has to read DM, it. <laughs> DM. DM, DM Barry. Do not DM me your piss. Do not. <laughs> also, pictures of you drinking piss as well. <laughs> oh, my God. Did you see the subreddit, Wall Street Bets? Oh, yeah. And the guy was yeah. drinking the piss. Yeah. I did, Holy I did watch shit. the video, but I did see that it was the front page of Reddit. And I was like, it was oh. like It was like keyboard goop all over again. Which... <laughs> Didn't, I just didn't need that. Google that in your own time, not now. It's just like, why? You know, why? Why? People, you know, you make the wrong decision and your life just goes down a different fork in the path of life. And then you end up, you know, making a video of you drinking piss. For yeah. karma. In a cocktail. For, in oh, like... sweet, I get cool internet points. I drank piss on the internet. We would also... never do anything stupid on the internet. No, we'd ne <laughs> <laughs> never. Never. <laughs> never. <laughs> Uh, mm. remember that time, Barry? Baby no, bird. I don't. No? I don't what time? Nope. Nope. I remember anyway, we um, very, very funny. And then we did that thing for charity. Yeah, yeah, we did a lot of work for charity. Yep. Um. So yeah, this guy Sasha, he, he blacked out, 
watching Pedguin stream and then woke up to us. <laughs> so, <laughs> fucking hell! Wow, okay. that's that's pretty good. Uh, I mean, that's I that's guess. fourteen hours or so that you were you were out for. That's not good. You know, you were right. <laughs> I guess he was, you know, conscious enough to donate in. That should be a good good sign. Yeah, just make sure you're hydrated. You know, and also, you know, maybe have a wash or something. Oh yeah, you yeah, stick. you will feel much better um, if you're if you're super hungover. Oh, here we go. We got a message. Uh, is that Ash? I pissed in a box and kept it in my room when I was five. I was very shocked by the smell. I thought piss was just water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not uh... reading out that other one. That's horrible. The innocent uh... one of a five-year-old. You know, experimenting with their own piss. Yeah, it was a very wholesome. No, that's not the right word. It wasn't no, really it's not. It's not. It's not wholesome. It's um. Oh, this is the same guy who donated. Ash donated three bucks. I'm so sorry about the TikTok and the pig article last week. Oh my god, are you responsible for both of them? Wait, the pig oh, article. No. Which one was the pig article? They're about uh, medics. Oh, shooting pigs. Well, the medics don't shoot the pigs. They treat the wounds that have been shot into the live pigs. Yeah. This is what you missed out on, Tom. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's kind of fucked well, up. Well, thanks for bringing that up again, Ash. Um, I can only change my TikTok name every 30 days. So I'm Chiluminati Ass Frogs for a while now. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> oh, my God. Everyone can go follow Chiluminati Ass Frogs and... Um... You know, very cool. You boys are making lockdown bearable, and now I have the time to catch live instead of being a vodgob. So that's the benefit, really, isn't it, of lockdown? We get more people watching. I kind of would, you know, kind of <coughs> wish Ash, you know, wasn't be able to watch live and, you know, send in these donations about about <laughs> pig, art, pig articles and TikToks. You wow. know, yeah. sometimes I mean, you sometimes like vodgoblin is better. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes vodgoblin's better. Oh man, it makes me so happy that Vodgov or Vodgobos has spread to like it's almost permeated. all the streams now. Uh, it's infected everyone, everywhere. <laughs> everyone has to have that as their thing. Um, brings brings some joy. I think it's just heart. it's just laziness um, on our behalf to not come up with alternate names. <laughs> to be honest, yeah, it's <laughs> about right. Um, so, what do we usually what what segments do we usually have on this? Well, We've we got covered Bible the passage kind of... and riddle. Oh, have have we riddle done riddles yeah. yet? We got to do a riddle. <laughs> we haven't done a riddle um... yet. No. Should we save? I feel like we should save those for after the break to kick us off into a great start. Do you know what I mean? Those so are such. I... Yeah. No, no, such no. We got to give. We got to say it. We got to say the riddle before the break to give people like um... five ten minutes to guess the answer. Oh... It's like countdown. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like that. Um. I'm yellow and warm. (laughs) (laughs) Yellow and warm. (laughs) Consume me fresh. (laughs) Delish. Consume me late. (laughs) Um. So can anyone guess? (laughs) uh, I guess that's a good Uh, enough cue to go on a break. Should we go on a break? (laughs) Oh, God. Uh, Sure. sure, Let's let's have a uh, little little break. Um, Yeah, why not? jeez. Let me um, <laughs> let me get some get some music. Um, I guess we'll under back. over forward back. <laughs> Nothing's ever going to be that one. <laughs> reverse side. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Uh, in the break, uh, have a think about Simon's riddle. Um, because wow, it's a real it's a real stumper. <laughs> it's really... a real brain teaser. <laughs> um, I'll give sure... you a clue. It begins with P. Oh, very good. Oh, generous of you, Simon. How generous of you. <laughs> we aren't worthy. Um, and uh, go follow the Chirai podcast on Spotify, because that's very cool and helpful. Um, we'll be back in a bit. <laughs> uh, bye, man. Oh, there he I is. guess he can. There he fucking is. There he fucking is, a little fucking nerd. Fucking there he is. What the fuck? What? Little fucking pleb. Oh, thank you, sir. 
Thank we you. thought we were struggling to find a way to re-invite you to the call, but you can just hop back in, apparently. Yep, I am a tech genius. I do know I do know these things. Are we live? We are live. We're live on the interwebs. Uh, live the right answer now. was piss. The answer was piss. <laughs> wow. So, uh, there we go. Nice. Hope that, you figured that one out. That was a difficult one for the um for the plebs. They are silly. Yeah, they are. All they those are. plebs. Do we have a uh, Bible passage to kick us off into Just... section two? Yes, we certainly do, Barry. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. This is from Exodus. Ooh. Ooh we haven't had oh. one from Exodus yet, actually. I'm quite excited. Exodus 34.28. Moses was there. Moses was there with the Lord. That's all in caps. Oh, did they actually do you Lord... ca- that in the Bible? Did they actually put things in all caps? I guess the Lord has to be, because um, otherwise it's it's rude. disrespectful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moses was there with the Lord forty days and forty nights without eating bread or drinking water, and he wrote on the tablets the words of the covenant. The Ten Commandments. That's a pretty... Wow. That's a good one. That's a pog one, that is. Wow, that feels like the... Wow. I feel like I, you know, wish I could just be like, you have to write my name in capitals. That's a pretty good flex, right? Have they ever um, had to update, like, the terms of service? Like, do you now have to have the Ten Commandments, but you have to accept cookies on it or something? (laughs) Um, You know, because they're quite old. Things have changed. Yeah, what would you Good. add as the eleventh commandment, Tom? Um, uh, everyone just be fucking chill. Just be chill. You know, Isn't that one of them? Chill. I thought I learned at school the eleventh commandment was "Thou shalt not drop the ball." <laughs> oh. I'm playing rugby. Really? Did yeah. Of, did you play a lot of rugby in? Um... It was. Happy days. <laughs> uh, <sighs> okay, that's not a laugh uh, of a tortured man. That's um, a laugh yeah. of a. I wonder where, a, I wonder where Mr. Cox is man. now. Maybe he's dead. Mr. That's Cox, you in the chat? A happy reminiscing laugh. Is Mr. Cox here? Oh my God. What did Mr. Oh Cox used to say to you, Simon? He used to say he would look over at like. A uh, fourteen or fifteen-year-old girl, and he would say she'll be a looker when she's older. That's what that's what Mr. Cox would say. No, oh, so he wasn't, you know, problematic at all, Mr. Cox. No, very. It nice was a different man. time. It was the eighties. Oh, that was fine. Surely yeah. in the eighties, it's a different time. Oh my god, different shark. You know what else is in the eighties? Um, Landlord Super, a very cool oh. game from Yoshi's Games. Go and support very our boy cool. Greg. Very cool. Very Jesus. cool segue. Do you like that? That's a terrible like segue. That. I do like that segue. Oh, no. Okay, That's... right. That is Harry's attempt at a segue for Landlord Super. Um, is both it... Simon and I get one before the end of the stream. And oh, whoever's no. is the most uh, like, inappropriate um, is the winner. Nice. Was um, in the in the, the trailers and stuff, is that Tom Bates' voice? Surely not. It sounds like Tom Bates doing a voice. Is it? I'm not sure. I mean, I could have just asked him. Surely not. I could just no, because it's it's him. it's it's a scouse so then guy. Then if it's isn't not it? him, it seems like it's rude. It's a scouse guy. It's, it's... Yeah, not Birmingham. No, no, it's not the not the not scouse, but the the other one. Oh, never mind. Landlord Super available now. Early access on Steam. There we go, I got mine in. <laughs> wow. I'm I guess... Sorry. Have I just been muted for this entire time? Have you? I don't know. Maybe I've been muted on stream. Fuck it. Uh... Um... Can people hear Barry? Can you... Wait, no, nope. you say something, Barry. Ask people to do something. <laughs> uh, I pressed something. Uh, Gapper. That's where I work. Let's do the intro. Let's do the intro. It's about time for the intro, isn't it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, let me just... Oh, there's the capper. Who's going to do it? Who's going to say... What's the intro? What is Hello the intro? and welcome to the Chiluminati podcast. Lockdown. Read Shadow Legends. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, God. 
You got it. You said you'd be ready. You we you had like the most time to prepare. What are you talking about? I did it. I did. We didn't hear it. We didn't hear it at all. Can what you not hear it? that? That is a half. Oh. That's a small dick lockdown. Give me a big dick lockdown. Is it not coming across very well? Now, now, now it is. Across. Now I can hear it. I think I was just holding the phone in the wrong place. You're there on the go. phone. What? Um. Well, yeah, I'm playing it on my phone. Oh, okay, okay. I've Sorry. got YouTube on my phone. That's been. You get YouTube on your phone these days, guys. Yeah, that's pretty you cool. Ever heard of that? YouTube on your phone. Man, I stumbled across a really, really cool channel. It, uh, to the outset, it sounds kind of boring, but was endlessly intriguing, and I've been, I've been listening to lots of it. Oh, it was... Sid, did you start watching my channel? No, I, start, I found a guy called Sips. <laughs> oh. oh. It's, uh, it's actually really oh. funny. Oh. Um, don't know what the oh. fuck your channel is, Tom. I'll have to uh, see if well, that one... Uh, uh, wow. it's, it sounds boring, but it's, you know, intriguing. Uh, that's how I describe it. That's my sales oh. pitch. Oh, oh, you're the guy. You're the guy who did the city. So you're saying that thing. Barry, yeah. you're saying that Sip sounds boring. Oh my god. Um, yeah. Wow, that's actually pretty. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Guys, it's been a lovely tenure at the Oxcast. I um. <laughs> oh shit. I love. I love you all. Get some Fs this in is the chat it. for for Barry's job. That's gone now. It's gone. It's gone. My family. They're crying. Jerry, my child, he's he's crying as well. He's on the streets. Um, Just wearing like a sack. <laughs> that says Yogscast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yogscast yeah. sack. It's, oh, it's one of the ones the that Yogscast coffee came in. Wow. <laughs> uh, Yogscast coffee, available now at store.yogscast.com. Oh, it's nice. especially average. Quote our piss guy. Uh, very, very true. We got a dono, a generous dono of 30 bucks, a triple desi hundo from Holy Rick shit. Doobie. Oh, Rick. Working from home means I get paid to listen to three guys talking about drinking piss. <laughs> what a time to be alive. Now, I don't like that I I read that message immediately after saying Yogg's Cast Coffee, <laughs> available at store.yogg'scast.com, and then... And then drinking. It's not. It doesn't taste like piss. Those are unrelated messages. It's yes, yeah, totally unrelated. It does not taste like piss. It tastes like coffee. Um, that was really unconvincing. That was really unconvincing. Yeah. <laughs> I've I've seen it and I've tasted it. It doesn't taste like piss. But even I'm not convinced. It tastes great. Tastes like coffee. Question mark? <laughs> Tastes like ellipses coffee question mark. We'll, we'll add that to the branding along with uh, especially average. Am I going to get told off for this? I'm just no. letting you get sink on it. I'm just letting you sink on this. So just keep going. Let me just check my emails. I might have an email from... So who's going to tell you off? What Lewis will tell you off? What's he going to say to you? What's he going to say? Okay, I'll play Simon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you, Simon, you play Lewis. Okay. Who oh, am I playing? Wow. Shut up! Shut up! Oh, 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 fucking hell. Shut up! That's not, uh, what, I, that's not what I sound like. That Harry, is not what also, I sound like. You're also playing Simon. Um, with... Oh, oh fuck it out. Why is it? Diggy hole. No, coffee, I'm sad. especially <laughs> average. Oh, coffee, very average. Boo. Oh. Boo, I, I like blowing up frogs. Boo. Oh, he hello, Lois. You look angry walking into this room. I'm going to add this to the spreadsheet. That will show you. Oh, no, you not the it? spreadsheet. Oh, no. Simon's spanking spreadsheet. Wait, what? Yep, we it know exists. about the spreadsheet, Simon. We know about it. It's actually oh. spreadsheets now. It's filled. It's filled an yeah, entire spreadsheet. Yeah, they actually managed to fill an entire How spreadsheet. How did we even do that? Jesus. Google actually had to complain that it was taking up too much space on their servers. <laughs> oh my yeah. god. Jesus. <laughs> Sounds uh, believable. Sounds plausible. Um, oh, we got another message from Admiral Noame. Public service announcement. Always wear a condom. That way you won't accidentally wash your dick like Tom did. 
true. Tom? This person does not know what dick, dick, the difference between dick and balls. Dick does not equal balls. Um, just a reminder. Just oh, a P.S. Reminder. P.S. Simon, if the frog makeup thing doesn't work out, you could always do a funeral stream for the frog once it dies. Oh, my God. Now, that's a bit weird, isn't it? Admiral uh, Noem, are you all right? Are you okay, sir? Fucking, this is the serial killer. You Admiral Noem. Nice. Oh, it's your mod. We... This is your oh, mod. Yeah, we... he's my mod. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, <laughs> you know, don't upset him. Don't upset He'll him. He'll fucking he is... cut you. He'll he does cut actually you. know where everyone lives as well. It is scary. Um... He knows a way to cut the human body a thousand times without you dying. Oh, He'll do it. Oh, that sounds like a good YouTube video. You should, you should add that one to your channel, Tom. Wow. Hi, guys. Just... Admiral Noem here. Welcome to the YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to cut the human body a thousand times without the person dying. Oh, man. Do a thousand episode series. Oh, my um, God. Oh, that my God. God. <laughs> one cut a day on the that... person, and you keep them alive, and there's like a five-minute episode, like a little vlog episode every day. Um, do a as really sa- like as the saying goes, the first cut is the deepest, and that goes right on the bell end. <laughs> <laughs> this does not constitute as dick washing. <laughs> and then yeah. he gets demonetized, but that's okay because he's got like you know eight and a half thousand people on his Patreon. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Suck yeah. at YouTube. Um, no, well, well, it's got him. <laughs> Ooh. Um. Oh. Oh, here so, we go. Piss guy. <laughs> so it's difficult to follow, you know, conversations like that. It's difficult. Yeah, sometimes you get a bit left just like, hmm, what, how, how do you say anything? To Landlord super. <laughs> Landlord super. super. <laughs> Treat yourself to a lovely pint of Landlord super. There we go. It's like the, the advert. It is. Nice. Everyone's seen that, haven't they? They better have. If they haven't. <sighs> Bannum. Yeah. So, piss guy, Woodrow Wilsonson with a semi desi hundo. I got caught, caught up. I got caught up looking at my order history on Amazon and found I ordered a PVC didgeridoo mouthpiece <laughs> in 20. <laughs> That's just... <laughs> It's like I can't process what he's saying. You've got a didgeridoo mouthpiece. I, mean, I thought it... he was trying to be rude, but. I guess it is literally something you put on your mouth to help you play the didgeridoo. Who? 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 This guy, apparently. Who? Who this the kind fuck? Of shit orders on Amazon. Actively is playing a didgeridoo. Okay. And I that mean, legit um... blew my mind. Like, what the fuck? But he's got a question. What's the weirdest thing each of you've ordered um, from the oldest year in your history? Oh, we're not going to go through our Amazon histories. No, no, you yeah, you guys don't want. It's so boring. You don't want that. <laughs> yeah, it's it's really Ooh. boring. You you, you don't want to. Uh, uh, yeah, I think it's the anime body pillow. Um, <clears throat> you say that <clears throat> as if there was only one, Simon. The one, just the one that I ordered. Um, I was lonely. Um, my other anime pillows were lonely. They needed a friend <laughs> to join them. Um, oh, God. Oh, the the oldest Amazon order I can find is a book on Napoleon the Great. You like that, Tom? That Did you need one. that for your history homework? No, it's for my dad. It's my papa. Oh. That was a good papa? one. Papa? Papa, it's Father's Day or, or your <laughs> birthday. I bought you a present. To book on Napoleon. Napoleon. Uh, Napoleon, I ate that cunt. <laughs> oh. And then he just like tears the book in half. And it's a big, heavy book. Oh my God. He manages book. to just rip it in half. You know, like like weightlifters do with phone books. You know? Uh, Ooh. Uh, yeah. Pure power. Like the boy did with the peach. Oh, like oh yeah. The boy, boy did with the peach. Mobo. He ripped, he ripped that peach wide open. It'll never be the same after it. It will never be Yikes. the same. Uh, we got an update from Sasha, who passed out uh, during Pedgwin's stream and woke up during our stream. Okay. 
I was only out for seven to nine hours, which is how doctors is how much doctors recommend to be blacked out or sleeping. Can't remember which one. I was drinking freshly and locally lagered piss. Oh, so there we go. Oh, that's nice. Keep it local. Keep it in the yeah. um, local, keep it in the community. Support local businesses. Yeah, especially during these times. A lot of people uh, will home deliver piss if you. Yeah. Oh, fresh you from need the feet. It. <laughs> That boy and run. <laughs> that boy and run. God Fuck dang it, Bobby. Uh, what else? Uh, so how how is the podcast rating doing? How are we on the ratings in the podcast? Did we we were really ratings? high, and then we got we we fucking fell off the map. We Every, bombed. Everybody, Hard. everybody decided this is this is the worst. This is shit. They make references <laughs> to things that they. It sounds like they're drawing things, but we oh, can't yeah. see that. We can't see that. Uh, Fucking... Yeah, that, that's my very computer true. is not happy. Yeah, I don't know where we are on the ratings, um, but I know that the plebs can do something. They can just go and they can follow, and that helps. That's okay. what they have to do. Just go follow and how download. Else, how else can we get people people into this? Um, what? How else do you market like a podcast? Fuck, I have no idea. How do you? We've got to advertise it. Okay. Okay. Uh, we got People spend... need to get it tattooed. Get your cast slash chili pot tattooed on your forehead. It's free advertising for us. I was thinking okay. we could just do like a promoted tweet. Um, yeah. Do but you, also, do you... the idea of people getting head tattoos, that's also cool. Very um, cool. Um... That girl that wrote Ravs' name on, on her eyebrow. We need to get that, but with... The Chiluminati podcast. Oh wait, that's a bit long, isn't it? Also, we don't want to be confused with the the other, the other one. Oh, yeah, well, what's we're... our podcast called, and what's their podcast called? I don't know. I'm scared to open anything on my computer. Can you guys check? Um, yeah, we can do. Um... Maybe, yeah, maybe we need to branch out and we need to do like a cool collab with another podcast. You know, to get some aggregate. Oh, what about the views. Chiluminati podcast? Oh, what? We just make a, sounds great. We just make a second podcast and double upload and then collab with ourselves. <laughs> no, no, the other guys that do the Chiluminati podcast. Yeah, if you search Chiluminati podcast, a different it's it's the other it's the other one. It's on there. Okay. It's the other one. They've got a lot, you know. They 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 were they they've been uploading for a bit longer than us. We'll we'll win eventually. It's not about um... winning the battle, Simon. It's about winning the war. But ours like doesn't even appear. It doesn't. I right. gotta scroll all the way down to podcasts and videos. Top result is theirs. Ours, you gotta scroll all the way down, and there's ours. And um, um, yeah, yeah. Okay, right. What about? I don't quite know how we set this up, but this is a way we can get loads of people watching. Mm -hmm. Right. Are you familiar with the like the premise of the film The Ring? No, 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 no. Please cover. <laughs> okay, so in the ring, uh, there's this like cursed, cursed tape, and if you watch it, you die in seven days unless someone else watches the tape. Ooh. You get a phone call after watching it, and it says seven days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, right. We, I don't. But you have to make how... a, you have to make a copy of it, and then show the person the copy. Right. Um, if we can change the rules on the curse, and we just have it so it's like a link. Um, no, because then people they watch it. They get cursed, <gasps> but if they send that to someone else, it transfers the curse to them and it resets the clock. So people have to keep sharing the. Um... So you want to make like a website called like Am I Cursed dot GG. This, this is just like a chain email, like or or like something you'd see on like an Instagram post. Share this within seven days, or your mum dies. <laughs> something like yeah, that. But it's like one of those we, horrible things. Well, we've got um a fucking you know serial killer in chat already. They can go That's around true. and handle handle true. the dirty work. Um, the wet work we call it. The wet work. Uh, I don't know. I want to. I don't want to get that confused with all the piss stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. We call that the yellow work. The yellow work. <laughs> yeah. The red work. The red right. blood. Okay. The blood. Uh, we'll yeah, color code. Yeah. So the red work and the yellow work. Um, Isn't blood sometimes blue as well, though? No. I guess, like, um... And green. Isn't blood loads of different colours? I mean, different animals may have different coloured blood if instead of like being iron-based... Also, like what about copper, white blood cells? Why about 
Should this white blood as well? White blood cells. We'll call it, it the white. It doesn't blood. make your no. blood white. Does it not? No. Why not? Why not? Because your your blood would be pink then, wouldn't it? If it had red and white, why isn't your blood pink? It is kind of pink. pink. Have you ever? It is kind of pink. It comes out like a a, a deep red. That's just because it's been uh... oxidated. Oxidated. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's like semen barren. Oh my god. No, oh. Semen is, is white work. <laughs> yeah. We'll leave, leave that all for Simon. Red. What if it comes out red? What if me? your semen comes out red? Yeah. You might want to see a doctor. If you have any flecks of blood that appear in your semen, you need to see a doctor because there, there could be something wrong with you. Jesus, I mean, just imagine, you know, you just finished the business and you look down and it's all red. That's like 10 out of 10 nightmare scenario. I feel like I actually yeah. just chop my dick off and try and start again. Like start what again. I've heard grow, is, grow a new it's one. A, what I heard is it's a sign that you were, uh, if you wash your dick, that's what happens. <laughs> oh, oh. So that does yeah. happen. Put it out there. Yeah. You Landlord the super. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, Early access on Steam. You can buy wow, it now. Very it's good. cheap. Very I think it's got segue. like. Has it got twenty percent off or something right now? I don't know. Something like that. Maybe it's only ten. I don't know. I still feel like we should um interview a, interview someone. You know, I feel like we've Let's got get a Greg good... on. Should we interview Greg? Oh, I don't yeah. know. He's a nice Greg. guy. I like. He Greg. is a nice guy. That's the problem. We don't oh. want nice people. We don't want to like ruin their well, lives. Yeah, we're, we're not allowed. Their reputations. Nice oh. Uh, no who else can we have? We need, like, you know, Simon. You know, you've been you've been moving around the celebrity circles for years now. You must have some years. some numbers. That's true. Some numbers, some true. some phone-ins that you can get us. I mean, let's. Oh, let's see. What have we got? Uh, we got. Um, let's see. Um, oh, uh, what about Alex Parvis from Area Eleven? Is he still, is he, what's he up to these days? Oh, old Parv. Probably doing a lot of philosophy still. He was very into that. When, uh, that very was, into philosophy. That was just his degree. He was very into it, though. Um, um, oh, Tina Barrett. That'd be cool. I mean, Tina I don't Barrett? really know Tina Barrett. Do you not? No, we're not close. We're not, we're not close. Um... um uh, <laughs> oh my god. What? Nothing. <laughs> oh, uh, Duncan Jones, the director of um, Moon and uh, Mute. I know Duncan Jones. Oh, he's pretty cool. Um, he's probably kind of fun, isn't he? Yeah. What would you? What would be your first question to him? Um. Has anyone ever confused you with the YouTuber and streamer uh, Duncan Jones, aka Lalna? Oh. Um. Okay, he's cool. I like Duncan Jones. He made man, man made man made moon, right? Yeah, he couldn't get the username Duncan Jones because Duncan. Had that. <laughs> does Duncan still have uh, it? Embarrassing. No, I don't think. I don't think he does. Well, maybe he's sitting on it. Um, but it's yeah, it's um, awkward, isn't it? But then you guys met him at the the World of Warcraft premiere, right? Maybe Simon, you didn't, and maybe I Harry, wasn't. you didn't. So maybe none of us. You did. guys didn't meet him. No, I think Tom <laughs> Bates did. Tom Bates talks about meeting him. Okay, let's get Tom maybe... Bates on the show. Yeah, yeah we should talk Bates. about meeting. Yeah, yeah. Well, we interview Tom. We interview Doug and Jones through the medium of Tom Bates and his yeah. small twenty-second interaction with him. Oh my God, Barry! I, I... Out of the mouths of babes comes great wisdom. <laughs> you said medium through the medium. Oh. That's what we do. We get a medium on. We can talk to any dead celebrity. <laughs> oh my God. Oh yeah. All right, oh let's go on Fiverr. Fiverr will have some mediums. Who can oh we my talk god! To? Like, oh what? my god! Are there mediums on Fiverr? Of there must there be. There of must be. There are. But like, who would we oh. want to speak to though? What dead person? I mean, 
Can you think of any? <laughs> just anyone. You can talk to literally anyone. Literally anyone, Barry. Any famous dead person. Uh, J- Jesus. Of... Jesus. Okay, yeah. Jesus. I feel like Jesus is a nice starting block. You know. Yeah. If from we there, do Bible it... segments. <laughs> we can show. do the Bible segment with Jesus. He could read it out for us. <laughs> is that weird That'd though? Be nice. That's like. It's like his autobiography, though, you know. Well, you know, half, well, a slightly less than half of it is. You know, maybe you could read some of the Old Testament. I will give you uh, a psychic medium reading, amazingly accurate. No, that's not what we want. We don't want amazingly accurate. I will physically connect to your deceased loved one. That. Ugh. Is the one. Although we're going to have to lie and say the. Do you reckon actually, we can no? Do you reckon we can get them on this say... Discord call right now? Do you reckon we could actually? Do you reckon I can make this happen right now? It feels like we're just barely holding <laughs> shit together now, and it's just us <laughs> that have done this for a while now. Um... <laughs> oh my god, I I love it. I will summon a dead loved one to your dreams. <gasps> Oh wait, we've got we've got a medium on the on the line now. Oh, oh. He- hello, hello, it is me, Madame Chungus. Madame Chungus. Oh, yes. hello, hello, Madame Chungus. Madame Chungus, how are you doing? Where are you phoning in from? I am many miles away. Oh, in a spiritual uh... place. No, I live in Swansea. <laughs> right, okay. Ah, oh, um... does that put you closer to the hell world so you can contact the spirits, Madame Chungus? Why are you living in Swansea? It is very close to the other side of Cardiff. <laughs> okay, very cool. Um, how, how did you first discover your, your powers? Madam Chungus. I was a young girl in my village. Right, what village was that? Just, yep. Yeah. Anglesey. Anglesey. <laughs> ah, a lot of mediums do say they come from Anglesey, don't they, Madam Chungus? Yes. Is... The village was filled with those with the touch of the spirit. And when did you first realise you had this um touch? Um... I was in bed. And at the bottom of my bed was a naked old man. And he told me he was a dead man. And that okay. it was okay. a secret okay. I should tell you. Okay. okay. okay right, right, Ma- Madam, Madam Sungus, you sound a lot like uh, someone we know. Um, is, your, is your full name Madam Chungus of Death, by any chance? Uh, because we have someone. I have who... family from Sweden. <laughs> right. No, okay. no, that, that does explain the accent. It's a very unique combination of um, English, Welsh, and Swedish. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, so, Madame Chungus, so... we were wondering if, you know, Tom and I are both quite close with, um, with a great grandpapa ancestor of ours, Jesus. Could I you do make... need. I do need to say that I will only put in touch loved ones with their dead families. Yes, uh, yes. What were about you related orphans? to? Will you not do orphans then? That's pretty mean. What about the orphans? What I if spit you're like... on them. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's um. Is that part of your spiritualness that you know? Or yes. Okay. You'll die soon. <laughs> um, wow. So, can you tell us Madam a bit about some Chungus. of the readings you've done, Mad and Chungus? What um, you know, oh, what's like I a common read, reading you do? I read this very good book by Frank Herbert. <laughs> okay, right. <laughs> about a desert planet filled with giant sandworms. <laughs> Wow, wow. Chungus, was that like a psychic premonition <laughs> you had? Yes. <laughs> okay. 
Wow. It's, and um, was that a personal spiritual experience or were other people with you during that time? Yes, many other people were with me. I read it on the train. <laughs> oh. On my Kindle. Where do you find the most spiritual energy in your day-to-day life, Madam Chungus? What can people at home, you know, find as spiritual links to other loved ones? I have found a very special potion. That in- <laughs> can you see where this is going? A very <laughs> special potion that enhances my psychic powers. Tell and us more. The best thing is, t- I can never run out of this potion. I make it my. Can you tell where this is going? Where? Does anyone where? guess? Where? I can make it myself. <laughs> <laughs> I drink my own peas. And right. it strengths. Strengths. What is the word? Strengthens. Strengthens, Strengthens my, yes. My psychic power. <laughs> yes. Your piss medium. Oh, classic piss medium. Yes, I, I also. I also read uh, the piss leaves. The piss leaves. I don't think you should be having leaves in your piss, Madam Chungus. <laughs> How do you read the oh, piss what? leaves? What's the process uh, you for reading? You should probably go them. to the doctors uh, if you have leaves in your piss. You'll die soon. <laughs> oh, no. Madam Chungus, do not curse us, please. <laughs> no, no curses. Not no today. Curses, no. Although, actually, wait. Do you do curses, Madam Chungus? Do yes, I know one very powerful, very powerful curse. Uh, Is there you... someone you wish to be cursed? Can you can you curse our stream? Um, okay. So people will die unless they share it after. What is the name of the stream? It's the Chiluminati <laughs> podcast. Um, it's not the first one that comes up. It's, it's... the second okay. one. Okay. I curse. The listeners of the Illuminati podcast, Kose Hameha! Oh. Wow. Oh, I got a weird tingle in my spine. That was weird. Yes, uh, that's the piece. So, can you, can you explain, like, the, um, the TOS of the curse to everyone who's listening now and what they have to do? Mm-hmm. They must share the link within seven days. All y'all die soon. Okay, <laughs> Wait, soon? die soon is <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> open ended. We wanted a kind of ra- well rounded curse that was, you know, legally safe for us. Yeah. So, soon leaves I... a lot of loopholes. Yeah, if it's because soon, in like, you know, the grand scheme of things in the universe, like, oh, you'll die within a million years. Uh, that that doesn't really work for us. Um, we need to refer a bit... to by the word soon. I do not mean in cosmological or <laughs> geological terms. I mean specifically within the framework of the human consciousness and experience. Okay, okay, that's good. Mm, that is that's, good. That's, that's better. Good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in turn, still flexible depending on. Like you know, basically people's opinions. Like someone could take us to court because if they die, and they're like, "Oh, I died after like two weeks," that isn't soon. No, um, that isn't. If soon. they That's... take me to court, I curse the court. <laughs> they all die soon. <laughs> okay, Stop. once again we're <laughs> in we're in the same soon... loophole. Yeah, and uh, that sounds like we're going to have more legal problems <laughs> on our hands. Can we just use? In a week. Can you just say in a week? Yeah, just a week. Within a week. It's not how it... <laughs> These spirits are very fickle. Okay, right. Um, this is going to be a problem. Sure? This is going to be a are problem. Are you sure you're a real psychic? Ma- Would you ma- like me to do a reading for you with the tarot? Yes. <laughs> the tarot, yes, yes. 100% yes. Okay, I do the tarot. Okay. Let's see. Which one of you do I read the tarot? Oh, do do the same, both of us at the same time. Yeah, both okay. at the same time. It's easier. The five of wands. That means you will get five dicks in your ass. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow, Between right. you, oh, it may like... be... One of you gets three, 
the other gets two. Okay. Maybe one gets all five, and the other get no dick. Oh, shit. Well, that's not. <laughs> well, that's, that's not, not fair. fair. No. Right, we'll have to, uh, you know, we'll have to be aware of that premonition, Tom. Okay. Five of um, wands. The five of what is very spooky, actually. That is scary. That represents your future. Right. Now I will look at your present. Okay. The high priestess, she lie on her side. That means you are fucking. <laughs> what, right now? <laughs> right now? Yes. How I'm fucking. I am told by the spirit. <laughs> okay. My God, now I realized I will that we would actually at... get the real deal here. I will look oh, no, at this your is past. Legit. The Seven of Pentacles. <laughs> it means you had you had lots of money, oh. and you pissed it all away <laughs> on the, buying little figures of men. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, yes. Have you um... spent a lot of money on little figure of men? I th yeah, that is actually very, very true. I did wow, that's the way. That a is lot of weirdly. Money on that is weirdly true, actually. That is really close. Are you sure they aren't referring Please to your ventures? Is that not your ventures? Oh. Maybe. Are you, are you, are you Chungus? Are you getting some interference? Because we have a friend called Simon. It might be some interference you're getting on the psychic wavelengths. I've oh. never heard of this man that you refer. This handsome man. Of which you no, he's not handsome. No, it's the other one. No, You're thinking you, you definitely haven't. You definitely haven't heard of him. If you think that he's handsome and charismatic, you, yeah. You, you're thinking. Oh, you're thinking of the Simon Lane from LinkedIn. Yeah, uh, he is handsome. Oh, that one. Yeah, he's, he's yet the again, violinist. Yet again, it's another uh, like first, second result on search issue. Like Simon yeah, Lane is yeah. the second result. <laughs> we. I mean, uh, you guys need to sort out your <laughs> SEO. <but> <laughs> yeah, we do. Um, Wow, Madam Madam Chungus. Um, do do you have yeah. any follow up questions for Madam Chungus, Harry? Uh, no, I think I'm I'm creeped out. It's too much. Definitely oh. very spooked. Did you um, not want to speak to the dead? Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, sure, I mean, yeah, is that still an option? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Who is um, it? I Okay. Are um, can you not just do I've like got... an open call? Can we not just like make no, an open I've, call I've to the dead? I've got a relative. Um, so do you channel this person and you'll speak speak for them? They speak through my body. They, they um... get inside of my body through okay. my hoo-hoo. <laughs> right. I breathe in their spirit <laughs> up into my womb space and, and... it... Spread throughout my body, and then they they come through my mouth. <laughs> okay, well, and they and it'll be just as if we were speaking directly to them, not yes. to you. They will they will be talking to us directly. Yes. Okay, and it has to be a relative. <clears throat> yes. Okay, um, I've got an uncle called Tony, Tony Tony Clark, and um, he's but he, dead. But, <laughs> yeah, he is dead. Um, do you think you can? Do you think you can feel him, Tony, uh, in the in the world? Uh, because uh, I'll just give you a little backstory on Tony. Um, he grew up in. It's best um, that you tell me nothing. <laughs> no, no. Uh, he he um he grew I up in China. I have my fingers in Simon. my ears. I mean, Madame Chungus. He gr he grew up in China, and he has a very very thick <laughs> Chinese accent. He does. Okay. Very thick. I met him once. I met Tony once. Yeah, he does. Yeah, before he died. Very thick accent. Um, so it'd be really nice to be able to talk to Tony. For it'd a be lovely feel, to hear that, that, that I warm can accent feel his again. Presence. I can okay. feel Tony is he's entering me. <laughs> right, oh, okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh, Tony? Tony? Ni hao. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Tony, how you doing, mate? Fairly good. <laughs> yeah, Tony. Uh, why don't you give us one of those big long monologues you used to give us? It's getting. I think the phone connection to Madame Chungus is dropping. 
I think I'm losing Tony? it. Tony, Tony, but Tony, I'm trying to see that. I think I ain't there, ain't there the power cut in Swansea. <laughs> nice. Uh, okay, I think I think Madam Chungus is gone. Madam <laughs> Chungus, um, thank you. That was um. Yeah. Oh, uh, hey wanna... guys, I'm back. Si- <laughs> <Did I miss? laughs> Simon, <laughs> Simon, like it's been a wild ten minutes. I can't tell you about it. Yeah, oh. Where did you go? You missed. Um, we just had a psychic turn up. Oh um, no! Oh, that's terrible. I would have really liked to have spoken to her. I've got uh, a lot of dead relatives from China that I would have liked to have spoken to. <laughs> yeah, I think, like you know, I don't know how good she was. Um, right. The her medium connection kind of cut out a bit here and there. Yeah. Oh, that's a shame. That's a real shame. But still, make sure that you pay her though. Oh yeah. Oh, we found five pounds, wasn't it? Yeah, five um, pounds. Yeah, five five pounds. Um, Do you think you got any money's worth? Uh, probably you know not. What? Yeah, I do think I did. Um, no, she I was very nice. She was a very lovely good. medium. Um, that's the only medium I've ever met. Very nice. One of the one of the best. Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. I agree. Would medium um, again? Would medium again? I agree. Oh my god. Uh, maybe Madame Chungus can be your Twitch name, Simon. It's a good name. Oh yes. I feel like it, she probably already has it, so I don't think I'll be able to take it. Uh, that's true. Yeah, Madame so, Tungus would already own yeah. that, of, of course. Because she's a, per- a real person. Definitely. Yeah, hundred percent. Um. Oh my god. Good, good, good times. Um. <laughs> so. Uh... What's the next segment that we like? Have we done all the Dono boys? Which ones do we get up to? What do we get to? I think we got up to Sasha. A couple Coles. more. Show me to read some. <clears throat> I'll read the last two. Uh, Tyron Cutie donates to Semi Desi Hundo. Thank you. Thank you. It's very kind. They say, Hello, I'm enjoying my chili t shirt and hoodie, smiley face. I was wondering, what is your favourite item in Animal Crossing, Simon? What's your favourite item? Uh, the jukebox is really cool. It's really like old you... style looking jukebox with the fluorescent sort of lighting around it. Oh man, they're pretty cool. Pretty fucking nice. I got that from G, and I and I sent another one to uh, Duncan as well. So spreading the love, the jukebox Ooh. love. Because <clears throat> once you receive an item, you can then gift like a copy of it. You got to oh, buy it. That's cool. But you can gift it to other people. Okay, I like that. Very cool. Good answer, good answer. Uh, mm. Jangle Cat, donates to Semi Desi Hundo. Thank you. Um, and they say, hey dudes, loving the podcast format. I have a fact for you. Armadillos <clears throat> give birth only to quadruplets. What? Why? Really? I wonder why. What the fuck? But, Do I mean, does that just mean like... their average litter size is four? Or does it mean it's always four? It's never higher, never <clears throat> lower. They must have four boobs then. <coughs> uh, or four wombs. Yeah. Do they have four um, wombs? Uh, why not? Why armadillo not? nipples. Let's have a Google of this. <laughs> right, see. They only have two teats. Oh, that's a problem. That is not going to work. How's out, that going to work? If they have four babies. Oh my god. Wow. Whew. Jesus fucking Christ, guys. It's that. It's. It's a rewarding Google image search. Armadillo nipples. Okay, I got to find yeah. that. We can't show this because they literally are. I'll do it on my laptop. I mean, fine. they're packing. They got a. They got a handful. Let me see. Uh, okay, fine. Armadillo nipples. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. That's see weird. What I mean? <laughs> that is weird. Good lord. That is weird, isn't it? How they just look um, like that. Wow. Um, cool. If we show that, that's is it three day, that's a six day ban. That's a perma ban. Both. I think that is a perma ban for showing that. So let's not. Uh, if people in their own time want to. Uh, to research and search, find, you know, yeah. about the natural world, you know, it's good to learn up. The natural world is beautiful. And um, fucking hot sometimes. 
Have you, uh, on the subject of armadillos, have you ever heard of the <clears throat> fairy armadillo? Fairy what? armadillo. It's the smallest armadillo of the armadillo family, and it looks like a fucking Pokemon. Oh it's my god! One of the animals that looks most like a Pokemon See? I have ever ever seen. Have is this real or is this like a Photoshop it's, or a no? It's model. A real. Oh it's my a real god! It does animal. look like a Pokemon. It looks like a sushi. Yeah. I'd eat it. Yeah, yeah. He looks like, like a, <laughs> he looks like a sushi. Can you get a picture of him on the screen? Oh my god! It looks like a sushi. It's got a hairy body and a bunch of scales on its back. Oh my god, he literally uh, looks like you just pop him in your mouth and eat him. I think that's a dead one. Taxidermid specimen, yeah, that's a dead Jesus, one. Jesus, why is that the biggest oh, yeah. image you've oh, found so far? <laughs> I know, fuck. Like, I can't, I don't know what I'm doing. It, it just looks oh, like look the shell him. is underdeveloped, you know what I mean? It looks like it just needs to like harden a bit. Well, it's a baby one, so maybe it hasn't fully hardened. Presumably it comes out soft. <laughs> His fucking face. Uh, love it. <laughs> that's a dead one. No, he's yeah, dead. That's a dead one. He is dead. That's a dead one. Um, wow, can you keep them as keep... pets? I want to keep one as a uh, pet. I don't know. They're actually very uh -huh. vicious. They'll like rip your eyes out. But uh, citation needed. It is the animal with the biggest claws to body ratio. Ever. From, oh my god, I didn't even realise it's the biggest fucking boobs to uh, body ratio. <laughs> Jesus Christ, those bazungas. Their feet are huge. He had a real fucking pair of milkers. Good lord. Yeah, it was big. Um, people are saying it's ground type. It'd be ground slash fairy type, surely, if you're using the new, the new types. Oh my god, this is like a fucking riddle, isn't it? What? My top has scales. My bottom has boobs. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's an armadillo. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, I hate it. Let's find some armadillo riddles while we're at it. Always four do I bring forth. Oh, you know, that's of... it. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> uh, armadillo riddles. Great. Where Let's do see. armadillos live? Where are they from? Uh, Swansea, South America. <laughs> oh, maybe um, they are South American. Yeah, they're oh, pretty you cool. definitely get them in America, and I feel like South America. I mean, that's my guess. But pangolins are like the more like Eastern derivative. Yeah, I guess they're. I should, feel like should they're we more get like David India, Attenborough on here? Uh, yeah, um, I'll just call him up, uh, no. Harry, because I know David Attenborough. Let me yeah, yeah, I'd really love right to speak now. to him. I would really love to speak to him. So I'm oh, going to no, be Simon, here I the thought, whole time. I thought you had to, no, 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 I, I haven't got anything out. better to do. No, Simon, no, 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 I want to just, oh, I want no, to just Simon, stay you here. You've got to go put the cat listen. food in the tray. No, 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 the cats are fine. They've been fed. They've got plenty of food. They're actually pretty chill. I sewage is spraying into your garden again. I can't wait to hear David Attenborough. That's why I'm just going to stay here and just wait for him to arrive. I'm phoning him up now. Okay, you you phone him. Are you there? David, are David? Sir David? David, are you there? Sir David? Hello, Sir David? David, are you there? Sir David? Hello. It's Oh my god. Well... We both are willing fuck, to take the bullet. Fuck, we fuck both both of you at the exact same second. <laughs> Fucking fair play, Tom, to you. Fair okay. play. We did think it. you were willing we... to do that. I can't believe I had we... the most audacity. I wasn't going to fucking do it. Jesus. Fucking Barry was taking a big drink of his lemon squash. <laughs> nice. Um, wow. Well. Uh, yeah, so I don't think David's coming. Uh, I, think, no, I think he's no. annoyed we just called him on like five different phones. Oh, poor David. Oh, Dave. Oh, my oh, Dave. God. Um, but yeah, bam. There you go. A fairy armadillo. That's my creature of the week for our new Ooh. creature of the week segment. Um, what have you guys it's brought? It's our creature of the week. Um, um, now it's an official just, segment. It's weirdest jingle. creature. Oh. Uh, so I watched, there was this show on um, Netflix, which was um, The Man like Who's Got Tigers. 72 Most Dangerous Latin American Animals. Oh, and God. They, wow, that's so specific like, of like the number and the geographic location. <laughs> yeah. I love, I love um, it. 
And each hour long episode, they would oh look my at God. seven different animals and rate them against each other on which was the most dangerous until Thanks. they have like the grand seven. finale of the most. Yeah. And there's an ep- uh, there's 72. But yeah, that's I think not on some episodes multiple... they have eight. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Uh, Fuck, that sounds really good. So what was it like? Um, It's kind of just like an elongated one of those online tier, like not tier lists, yeah. it's like bracket bracket that's lists. Do you remember when exactly, everybody was doing exactly, the March Madness yeah. brackets? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I like those brackets. Although, they were fun. Uh, on this show, it felt like they ran out of ideas on some of them because they put sloths on there. Um, very dangerous animal, very dangerous. Because uh, I think there's basically like 80 animals in Latin America, and uh, they were like, oh, those bottom eight, they can't be in it. So we have to use basically every other animal here. And some really felt like they were pushing, you know, pushing it. Because when they're like, oh, this deadly viper, it will kill you in four hours. Oh, Next fuck. up, the sloth. And you're like, what? oh, yeah, I wonder if this is going to be in the running for the most dangerous animal in <laughs> Latin America. And some woman had a story about, like, it held onto my finger and it was really painful. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, okay, compared to, like, the person who got bitten by a snake uh, and it has, like, neurotoxin and, like, 10 years later is still having to do physiotherapy. Did like, they have, okay, like, any that, like jellyfish? very serious. I don't think jellyfish... I don't think because you know what happens if you get stung by a jellyfish. What you should do? Uh, oh yeah, uh, buy landlord super, and that will make the sting <laughs> go away. That does it. It uh, softens the sting. It. Yeah. Oh yep. my god! Uh, it's a little trick. Uh, um, no, boom. Life yeah, hack. There you go. I thought uh, pissing on this. I thought the piss thing didn't actually work. I thought that was a myth. Isn't that a myth? Yeah. yeah it was just invented by perverts. Oh, so, but it's hanging so around on beaches. Oh, you just got stung by a jellyfish. Oh, I know a cure for that. Uh, let me just unzip and, uh, oh, yes, this will this will clean your eyes up. Uh, and they just sat uh, there with, like, gallons of water and just when they see people get stung, they just start drinking. They yeah, start yeah, yeah. going they drink for it. loads of water. They tactically <laughs> place dead jellyfish yeah, they've all got, like, around. A, they've got, like, pet jellyfish that are trained. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These um, fuckers. Well, I was picturing more like, oh, they see like a group of people playing like volleyball, and uh, you know, like in the Shawshank Redemption, where he like walks along and he's letting like sand out of his trouser leg. Yeah. He has like a special jellyfish shoot down his trouser leg. Oh. <laughs> Flops like a jellyfish down as he walks past. He's like, all right, everyone. Oh, that's that's Plot dangerous it. though. Oh. Keeping jellyfish in your trousers. That's you that's why you have a special jellyfish deployment shoot. Yeah, jelly a jellyfish uh, condom to protect you. To protect your, yeah, your yeah. unwashed dick from a jellyfish. Okay. And <laughs> you launch that bad boy down. Someone stands on it. Oh, owie, owie, my foot. Owie, owie, how do I stop the hurt? Sir, stand Suddenly, back. Boom. Stand back. Psh- I know how to solve this problem. I'm oh, trained yeah, yeah. in piss aid. <laughs> piss aid. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. Just pee all over that. Oh. Uh, Has before... anyone made piss aid? Where maybe you've got a soda stream at home. I bet, I bet you could, I instantly already feel like that is a video on the internet somewhere. No. Just, I have no doubt in my mind that no. is a fucking thing. I reckon there's um, multiple of that video. I, I'm going to go out there and say there's certainly more than one. Yeah, yeah, 100%. And now it's a TikTok, because that is... that's what our fans are like. Ugh. Um, uh, Ugh. Well... Also, just who who does have soda streams? Who owns a soda stream? Um, it feels like every American. I don't yeah. feel like it's not. A, it's not a very British thing, one? is it? No. I had one really. when I was a kid. Did you it piss was quite, it, Simon? It was when it was hot. It was the hot new thing. Get a soda stream. It was um, yeah. It's horrible. Absolutely horrible. Yeah. Yeah, really, it's, um... it's never really just been a thing. Lots of people in chat have them. What the WTF fuck is a solder is a stream? stream. Um, <coughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It was it's just a thing, that, a thing that carbonates um, like liquid that you put in. And didn't you had to get like special 
very sugary, like uh, syrup. like squash syrup stuff that you had mm. to put in. Um, and yeah, it just wasn't wasn't great. It wasn't good. No, um, it's basically just weird shit versions of stuff that you could probably buy a shit cheap version of anyway. Yeah. What about like tomato soup? Could you like carbonate tomato soup? Oh, I bet. I bet you can. What about, like, V8? Um, but like bread batter. You carbonate the bread Wait, batter. V8 carbonated anyway. I'm pretty sure there is like a carbonated V8. Oh, God. Um, okay. I bet there just is a fucking Soda Stream channel. Um, I Soda Streamed it. Weird, weird shit in. Oh, it'd be, it'd oh be my like, God. Sh- Ashens oh, Soda Stream. Yeah. Ashens and Barry did a fucking. What? You know, Bartians. They did a uh, Will It Soda Stream video pretty recently, but I haven't watched it. Oh. If I'd watched it, think... now would have been a great time to mention, you know, what they did on it. Oh, that'd be I'm good. Sh- yeah. And give but I haven't watched credit. it, so I can't I can't comment. Will It Soda Stream? Oh, that was yeah. uh, September 2018. <laughs> yeah, really <laughs> recent. Very recent. Really I think recent. it appeared yeah. like on my recommended videos recently. That's probably why um, I thought it was new. What do they do? What do they? Yeah, what give us our list? Their list of ingredients. What do they do? Milk. Um, milk sounds horrible. That they do milk. Good. That's not right. That just sounds super bad. Oh, they do super... soup. They're doing soup. Okay. Okay. That's that's that looks horrible. They got like Heinz soup, oxtail soup. Which flavor? Ooh, I like oxtail soup. Oxtail soup. Man, big fan of oxtail soup. Um, wow. Okay, we are now just watching. Are we all just sat watching a fucking video? Um, I wouldn't say it's the optimal way to drink oxtail soup, says Ashens. So there we go. He's doing God's work. He's doing Not God's the work. optimal way. Uh, so maybe don't bother. Maybe just you know heat it up on a you know in a pan. Um. Just drink it that way instead. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, just don't experiment. Just just do it. Just do it the normal way. You don't know better. It feels like iced tea would be really nice, though. But just why not just get, like, some lemonade uh, yeah. and just put that in some iced tea? Like, um, you know. Yeah, you could just do that, actually. Like, putting lemonade in any of these other things basically achieves the right... Lemonade and oxtail soup. Mmm. Mmm. It's like a cocktail. <laughs> so they did uh the Will It Soda Stream video and uh that was like seven seven hundred and seventy thousand views. Uh they also did a much less popular Will It Crepe video. Um <laughs> Will It Crepe doesn't doesn't feel quite as clickbaity a or as exciting as um, <laughs> will it will it soda stream? Um, man, will it crepe? Will it crepe? Will it toasty? <laughs> yeah, very good. So ch- yeah, check out Barry Barry Lewis on YouTube is where these videos are. Barry Lewis. He stole my name. Also known as Ashen's pal. He stole my fucking name. I mean, it's probably actually his real name. You know. Oh Probably, my god, what if yeah. what if he is actually a Harry that's going by Barry as well? Oh my, oh my god. god. Oh my god, Wait, he probably is. Your name was Barry, but sometimes you go what? by Harry. No, it's it's the triple the triple flip. My name's Barry, I go by Harry, but then I sometimes go by Barry. Okay, right, that's fine. When does Larry come into it? <laughs> Gary. When I need to a fake identity, I just you know, change it easy. Boom, what about I'm Barry. Just... About boggies, did uh, you say? <laughs> what about poggers? About boggers. Um, Have we landed on a name for Simon's stream channel? Did we decide? Did I we think confirm? we're going to go with uh, Simon Honeydew. Frog, frog blower. Um, frog blower 69 has uh, a nice 69. ring. 69. Yeah, I think it's just like, lets you know where you stand. Like, you, you hear that and you're like, oh, I know the kind of content this person's going to do. And you can just like latch onto it. And then it's Animal Crossing, and then they're like, oh. Um, oh. Is that Puddles? Uh, oh, puddles? No. She's the frog. Frog uh, villager. Oh, no. <laughs> Please. I would oh, never goodness. blow Puddles. We could always just give you the stream key to the, the Oxcast account, and you could just go fucking, you know, dog wild. 
really fuck up the stream Just schedule. Just go fucking ham. And I got um, it on my phone. There you go. For Bas- emergencies. You're basically but, halfway. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, what else would you stream, Simon? You know, do about Animal Crossing. What would what would no, some delights? I think that's it. I think it's just going to be just Animal Crossing. I may as well call myself um, Simon plays Animal Crossing. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. Um, okay. And then yeah. you're fucked in the future. Um, or oh no, what's it? What's it called? OMFG Animal Crossing. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, what OMFG? It's cat or whatever the fuck it was. What was that his yeah. name? Yeah. You got to future proof your usernames a little bit, guys. Just learn from this. Yeah. How are Preb's usernames? Will Cubed underscore. It's all right. Gary Bolty. That's one of the best usernames ever. Gary Bolty. Gary Bolty. He made his account just this month. Gary, welcome. Welcome, welcome to Twitch, Gary. Gary. He subscribed and everything. Look at him. He's so set up. What a lovely boy. What a fucking wholesome <laughs> little bleb. But he's actually a sub. Yeah. So he's not a pleb pleb. No, he's just a, just a little bleb. A regular pleb. Gary, it's nice pleb. to have you. It's nice to have you, Gary. Yeah, you know what? They haven't got some awful usernames. I haven't seen too many that make me, you know, sad. No one's... Lobsters are farm animals. Well, hmm. Is that a username? Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, not sure about that one. Lobsters underscore are underscore farm underscore animals. And oh they got the capitalization. Oh, oh my God. God. How? How do you end up there? Shooting fish. Sure. <laughs> giving all these free shout-outs to people, and and people like Critical Slinky aren't getting their messages read. Oh, my God. They're not. Sorry, go ahead. Slinky. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, man. I missed the first part of the podcast. Did you guys already do the best part Bible time with Simon? <laughs> we did, and it was a classic. It was a classic. It was Moses and the Ten Commandments. It was a real, oh. it was a banger. Classic oh, an S-tier Bible passage, if I ever heard one, read one. Yeah. It was one of the best, actually. Big fan. Big fan of old um, old Moses. Good boy. They should make the Bible into a movie. Or like a Game of uh, Thrones like series. Oh, okay. An anime series. Like an anime, <sighs> yeah. I bet, I bet that fucking is one. Man, that would be so cool. Oh, Chan, what are you doing with that tablet? <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, it's not. Maybe, maybe anime Bible was a mistake. Anime Bible. We need to copyright that right now. Can, has anyone got the username on Twitch? Anime Bible. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Um... Should we just ban? Let's just preemptively ban that person from our. <laughs> yeah. Just ban them. We don't need them. We don't need oh, yeah, that some... kind of. That user doesn't exist. They don't exist. Simon, register it. Oh my god. Oh my god. How do you? Oh. Ugh. Oh no. No. Anime Bible. One word is 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 this? They're dead. They're dead. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Oh, that's such a good Did username. You see the film Prince of Egypt. No. Was that Disney or was that what, Prince of Persia? Was probably. The one with the um, works. the guy with the eyes. Oh my God! Yeah, what? um, Donnie Darko. You know, with the, the guy um, with the eyes. What? He has got the eyes. You know what I mean? Tom knew instantly what I meant. He's the what guy anime with the eyes. eyes. Serious eyes. Jake Gyllenhaal. Barry. Jake Gyllenhaal. Jake Gyllenhaal. Yeah. That's it. He's got the eyes. He's got the eyes, Simon. Got the eyes. Yeah, that Prince Black, of Persia like movie was um. Eyes. It was pretty trash, wasn't it? Oh god, it was so bad. That was such a trash film. Are you So you're saying Prince of Egypt? Isn't that Prince Isn't that Prince of Persia? No, Prince of Egypt. Have you seen wow, the movie that's... The yeah. Prince of Egypt? Are it you was... confusing movies? Oh my god, is Did this you... an anime? It's an anime, Tom. Oh, um, actually I think is... I have seen this. 
as a kid. I think I watched it. Is it the Disney animated Disney. one that looks like a Disney? 1998. Uh, who made that? Is that the one with Let My People Go? Yeah, 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 yeah. That okay. song. Oh, fucking Yef is in Man. it. Yef is in it. Don, Don, Danny Glover? Wasn't that a sla- It was like a like an African American slave song that they used for like the Jews in Egypt. I think so. It's a bit weird. It's a bit weird. It's a bit um, weird. Ralph Fiennes is in it. Oh, I like Ralph Fiennes. Helen Mirren's boy. in it. This cast is pretty Rafe. pretty all star. Uh, actually, it's pronounced Rafe. Patrick Stewart is in it. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> the, the voice acting cast for the Prince of Egypt is very all star. Oh, all star! Did they sing that as well? Hey what? now, yeah, all star, yeah, mom. Uh, yeah, he said that as he was marching through when he split the Red Sea, and oh, everyone wow. sang that. Ah, uh, um, and they're doing like a cool choreographed like da- like dance as they're like dancing through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man! Yeah, exactly that. And oh uh, the. It is gold, but it's like all red because it's the blood. Um. Oh, I like that. Man, oh I, have you seen this movie? Don't I? I vaguely remember it. I saw that movie when I was a kid. When I went, I used to go to a Christian youth club. Jesus same, and... same. I went for like, I went for a little bit to one. Um. When we went to uh see. The Prince of Egypt with Christian Youth Club. And, that is some, that um, is some gang shit. That is some gang shit. I bet you got shit. so much pussy back then. <laughs> man, holy shit! Like I was, I was rolling. I was rolling. Um, and yeah, we went and saw Prince of Egypt, and I was like, yeah, it's, it's all right. Um, it's all right. I like that song. Let my people go. That was the fun one because that's when they show all the plagues and and that's what basically like you're waiting for. Yeah, story. that's the yeah. good shit, um, isn't it? The burning bush is kind of cool, um, you know. It's a bush, but it's burning. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> um, yeah, that's always like a good, a good like a good thing. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what. Yeah, what else? Did you go to a Christian youth club, Simon? Harry and I both went to Christian youth club. Yeah, that's what made us the people we are today. Done. I'm pretty sure oh. that th- there was a, a youth club run by the church I went to. Mine was specifically called Christian, 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 wait, it was called CU or Christian Unity or something like that. I don't know. I don't, I don't think they worried, it. I don't think they worried much about religion. I don't think we were like reading stuff out of the Bible. That's what I did at primary oh. school. I had scripture as a class. Scripture? Fuck me, I forgot you were from the 1920s. Yeah. <laughs> um... Scripture. It was the eighties. Soda streams. Landlord super. Landlord super. Um, my God, wow. Uh, yeah. Maybe you should have stuck with your Bible studies, um, and you wouldn't have turned out this way. What? Yeah. What do you mean? I mean, consorting with mediums. They're doing the devil's work. I wasn't even fucking here for the medium, so you can suck my fucking dick. Oh, that's true. That's not very Christian thing to that say. That is a very fucking Christian thing to say. <laughs> <laughs> that's not very fucking Christian. Come. I wasn't consorted with them. You can suck my fucking dick. I'm the most fucking Christian around. Oh. Now, fuck off. <laughs> um, wow. Oh. Wow. Has Christianity, um, you know, changed much since we were all doing it in the, when we were kids? You know. Uh yeah. Um, pets go to heaven now. Oh really? That's nice. Yeah yeah yeah. Well, yeah, that's Pope... kind of bullshit. <laughs> Pope said pets pets now go to heaven. Um, oh. The Pope's kind of cool. seems like kind of a nice guy. You know, he's just trying to trying to be the Pope. He's out there. It's kind of cool. Yeah. He has a cool hat. You know what? Like, you know, That's like right, every yeah. good role, like when we just started the podcast, every good job and role oh, has yeah. a good hat. And the Pope is one of the Fire finest. Chief. Yeah. And I want to look at Fire Chief hats again. They're really cool. Do you think he only yeah. got the job because of the hat? He was like, oh, I really love the hat. I, th- I just I I want to wear that actually hat that's, so That bad. is a big problem when they are finding new Popes, trying to get rid of the ones that are just in it for the hat. Yeah. Um, 
and actually trying to find people who are serious about you know like doing good works um oh do you reckon they have to ask you like lots of trick questions to try and figure out if you're just in it for the hat yeah yeah 100 percent, man it's what, definitely definitely what good works though. do the what good works does the pope do um exactly. that's correct uh, fights crime you know. like batman he is batman yeah, yeah. yeah okay um you know stops wars happening. does he fight crime purely within the bounds of the vatican city <laughs> yeah a zero percent crime rate yeah a zero so he's percent. very successful yep although actually isn't it per capita the vatican city is like off the, the highest murder rate on um like crime because there's like pickpocketers and stuff there but like very few people actually live there but it's a massive tourist spot and, it has like a uh, static population of a thousand people um and uh so yeah like per capita there's like like a thousand pickpockets um per person that lives there um, oh my god does the pope uh, have or... the funnest car of all the mobiles that our superhero people have is he Ooh. as he does he win well because he drives the batmobile because he's secretly batman <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. He presses a button and <laughs> the Pokemobile transforms into the Batmobile. Wow. Because who's the last person you're going to suspect? It Probably is the Pope. The Pope. Right? Yeah. The Pope. It's the perfect fucking like, disguise, this, this alter ego. Do you reckon the Pope's oh ever ordered someone to be killed? Do you reckon he's ever put a hit out? You know. That's not his style. That's not. His style. No, he'd like do it himself. Eight. You're right. He would do it himself. Oh yes, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He won't trust other people. He'll do it himself. Um, I'm not going to kill you, but I don't have to save you either. And then he just oh leaves people god. to die. Oh my god! Wow. He uses like a big Bible as a weapon. Uh, oh that'd god. be cool. I think like a big um a big cross. That'd be good. Oh, but it's like it's like um, a it's like a lectern and a cross. We've got like an open Bible book on it. I'm yes. trying to think of the weapons that Constantine used in the, the Keanu Reeves movie. Didn't he He's have got some, the like... like shotgun that is like a cross made of yeah. silver. Yeah. Uh, oh, what does like fire two shots out sideways as well? Oh, I wish. I wish. No, it's oh just, my like, God, that would the, be amazing. Like the pumping bit is got like a crossbar so you can hold it up and it's a cross, but it's like a shotgun. Man, That's I amazing. That film. Constantine was an amazing. Shia LaBeouf. Movie. Shia LaBeouf. Uh, he's what a surprise! Yeah, as like taxi like, driver. Hello, it's me, Jeff, the taxi driver. Um, you want me to wait outside? Oh, can't I come in and do an exorcism? Oh, John, you're so mean, but I love <laughs> that's you. That's how he spoke. Oh my god! Wait, <laughs> do we do we have uh, Shia LaBeouf on the line <laughs> right now? Shia, is that you, Shia? Wow, our hello. producers did a great job. Shia, how you doing? I'm very good. Have you have you seen the movie I did? It had a disabled in. It's very good. Which one, Constantine? Yes. <laughs> okay, very cool. Is Constantine your favourite movie you've ever done, Shia? I'd have to say my favourite movie I've ever done was Shia LaBeouf sits in a cinema and watches whatever it was that I watched. It was great. Okay, that's cool. That's um, cool. Did you what? know that my my name's French and it means the beef? Oh, Shire, Shire the Beef. Shire the Beef. Why do they call um, you the Beef, Shire? Why? Oh, I love beef. <laughs> uh, Shire, you were in the Transformers movies, um, weren't you? Yeah, that's um, right. Uh, which is the nicest Transformer to hang out with, you know, just while you're hanging around the set in between shoots? I'd have uh, to say B Bumblebee. <laughs> Bumblebee. 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 Why Bumblebee? Yeah. Oh, he always had a, a cold can of Fanta for me. A cold? Do you like? Do you like Fanta, Shire? <laughs> oh, I'm mad for it. That and beef. That and beef. Uh, wow. Wow, an Fanta interesting little fact. Beef. I was thinking um, of calling myself Shire LaFanta. <laughs> Shire LaFanta. <laughs> LaFanta is a fun, fun surname. Yeah. Um, it turns Shire. out, though, that the, the Fanta Company did very naughty things back in the 1930s and 1940s. Or... Well, Shire, oh, yeah, you know a lot true. about that because you featured in Brad Pitt and Fury, didn't you? You know, That's very true. Is that yeah, where your love of Fanta... That. No, okay. Is that, is that the one where they they have to kill Hitler? <laughs> yes. Uh, no, that's the other. The other. Oh. But uh, you've got... There's the tank. There's a tank. There's a tank. 
Oh yeah, that was the tactical fury, wasn't it? That's right. That's right. Yeah. Very good. Um, did, well done. Did son. you know did. that that tank that was that was Bumblebee? He got that role. <laughs> that was Bumblebee. Transformed into a tank. Oh my god! Very cool. Wow. Oh, is that a, um, that a cold fanta? <laughs> um, did you drink much fanta while you're on set uh, in Indiana Jones and the Crystal Skull? By any chance? Um, uh, no, I had Crystal Pepsi instead because I sponsored it. <laughs> That's why wow. it's called Crystal Skulls. Crystal Skull. Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Pepsi. Was yeah, the, that's um, what it was the... originally going to be called. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's... But then the funding fell through. Pepsi didn't want to pay for it because it were a shit film. So we had to change the name and we had to CGI out all the cans of Pepsi we were holding. <laughs> okay. That's oh. why they were monkeys attacking us originally. It was cans of Pepsi. <laughs> okay. Is that good? That's why the CG having, looks a bit ropey. Having things. your product like attacking, you know, beloved hero Indiana Jones. Do you think that was like a good call? Maybe that um, was why they didn't go for it. And then, yeah, mistakes cause... were made. <laughs> um, yeah, wow. What, was uh, it, the uh, what, what other films were you in, Shia LaBeouf? Um, uh, uh, I was in. Uh, you were in, in that show Even Stevens I watched as a kid. <laughs> what? Do you remember, remember Beans? Do you remember, remember Beans? acting in Oh uh, yeah in Even Even Stevens? Oh yeah, it were me and it were uh Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen. The Olsen were they twins. in it? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Like, oh shit. What was your highlight from uh, from filming Even Stevens? Gary Coleman I? was too. Gary Coleman yeah. was <laughs> really <laughs> Sire. Are you okay, Sire? Yeah, fine. Um, Shire, just before your performance in Constantine, you were a small feature in iRobot. What was it like, you know, acting alongside Will Smith? Was he in iRobot? No fucking way. Yeah, he was in iRobot. <laughs> He's in iRobot, apparently. I played the taxi driver. <laughs> I was a bit worried. <laughs> You know, coming off the back of Constantine and having another role as a taxi driver. I thought I'd get typecast. Okay, as just the taxi driver. Yeah. Um, right. Okay. I want to see what he did in iRobot. He's a guy um, called Farber, and there's a picture of him, very young Shia LaBeouf, next to a wolf moth. Okay. I'll put it in Twitch chat. Um... Oh, it doesn't work. Oh, oh it does work. That doesn't work. <laughs> Let's copy the link. Ass hot spankable is a line what? that you said, Shia LaBeouf, in uh, <laughs> iRobot. Shia, what do you have to say? That means, you know, these claims that's that the only that line. line I had in the whole movie. He described Just someone something as ass hot spankable. Uh, it was a very, it was a very good scene. It was just me. Uh, and a mirror, and I was just looking at myself when I said the line. <laughs> really? How many takes uh, did that take? I just one take scene, because you're, I was so stood... convincing. In this clip, you are uh, stood with Will Smith walking down the road, not in the mirror. No, that was all CG. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, I never met wow. Will Smith. Uh, <laughs> what would you say to Will Smith if you could, you know, say something to him right now? Can I have some money, <laughs> please? <laughs> Can I have some money? Uh, is money a bit tight at the moment? Just a grand or something. Shire, Five you, grand. A bit, a bit tight on cash these days. I've not um, been in a hot, you know, a good movie. In actually, I've never been in a. No, I was in Constantine, and that's a good movie. Constantine. That was actually, good. I robots quite good, but I'm not really, you know. No, I mean, to be honest, not... most of the good movies I've been in, I wasn't, you know, like a lead in them. Um, I quite enjoyed Fury. Fury was quite Fury good. Fury was you good. good yeah. in that. I liked you in that. Yeah. Thank um, you. Thank you very much. That you were in the. To uh, just to remind you, you were in the adaptation of the book Holes. You know. Oh Holes. yeah. Oh, so I never saw that, but I heard it was like meant to be. Yeah. Like, all right. Because you yeah. know the reason I took that role is because I'm a fan of Swiss cheese. <laughs> Right. And I thought so it was beef, about Swiss cheese and Fanta. I'm that... mad for it. I was going to change my name to Shia Le Fromage. <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> uh, but 
He settles on beef. Um, yes. Uh, uh, oui. <laughs> uh, okay, very French. Uh, can you speak much other French for us? Um, Un petit sire? peu. Nice. Petit peu. Did you um, do you have much okay. French family, oh, Shire? You got much French relatives? Uh, yeah, my mum's French. Oh my god. Uh, my dad's French too. Don't <laughs> say so you're pretty uh, French. <laughs> so I'm half Shire. French, <laughs> and I'm, I'm also half the other half's also French. Um, would you be able to give us a like a tidbit of your acting by any chance? Mm. Um. Because I heard that you're starring in a new movie where you pay, like, play a, a, a very thick, accented Here we go. Here we fucking boy. go. Yeah. Uh, would you like to give us just like a taster of the new film? Oh, it would be so um, exciting to get an exclusive from you, Shia. It'd be so great. It'd really help our podcast. I'm um, sorry, actually. but for contractual reasons, I cannot do that. Actually, the director did actually say I, that you could do it for I do have the director um, of the studio podcast. with me and he is nodding currently he's nodding and it is a big thumbs up I don't he's believe nodding, you <laughs> he's nodding big thumbs up I don't up. believe you he's grinning and um, he's nodding he's, he's nodding a nodding. lot yep yeah. uh, actually he he looks almost angry that you're not doing it now he's getting frustrated um, it looks like um uh so I think you're gonna have to have to give he's, us like a he's written taste. on a notepad Shire's check and he's holding a lighter to it Oh, uh, I need the money. <laughs> so this, so this was, I was playing a Chinese man in the role of Hamlet. Okay, uh, that's correct. That is correct. <clears throat> let me just, <clears throat> let me just clear my throat. <clears> throat> oh my God! Wait, uh, this uh, uh, narr- narrative. Uh, they actually just gave us some information. Um, the location of the film has actually changed to Jamaica, and the, oh. the director is nodding. An, an, interest, an interesting <laughs> last I play minute. a Jamaican in the role of Hamlet, and it's about the making of the play Hamlet. Uh, yes. <laughs> it's very um, meta. It's very deep. To be or not to be, <laughs> that is the question. When it uh, is noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles, and by opposing at them, to die. To didn't, Stop me any time! Stop me I didn't realise, sorry, um, Shia just ran out, and Arnold Schwarzenegger <laughs> just joined us, everybody. <laughs> Arnie, and just everybody. read, Arnie, just read from the park. The Thank you, Arnie. Welcome Arnie. to the stream. I didn't realise um, they just up. You know the Shire casting. Wow, Arnie, how are you I'm doing? I'm very pleased to be here. <laughs> how are you doing, Arnie? Very um, wow, unexpected. We did not think to have you seen like... my tiny horses. <laughs> I have. They, Arnie. Are, they are comically I... small. <laughs> they are small horses. It's um, funny what... because I am a huge man, and the horses, the horses are very small, but <laughs> right. I am very large. That is the humour. Um, wow. Uh, Arnie, so how, are you, how... how are you coping in lockdown, Arnie? How's it all going? You know, you you working out lots? Have you been, um, you know, relaxing? What have you? I love day? working out because when I work out, I get the <laughs> feeling of that is I am coming. I am coming all of the time. Uh, wow. <laughs> so, uh, wow. Uh, Arnold, very cool. Um, so we heard that you're going to be starring in a new film, Arnold, and you're going to be doing a reading from it for us today. Yes, that is correct. Uh, I feel like I don't. I don't need to introduce this at all. It's like, a because... film about the Great Wall of China. <laughs> <laughs> it has oh, a budget of eighty-seven billion dollars. <laughs> Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and who do you play in this? Uh, Swang film? Ji, a general of the Chinese army. <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> very good. Um, so, could you. Uh, apparently, you're going to give us a very impassioned speech um, that yes. you're giving to your, your troops um, just before the, uh, the big battle at the wall. Um, Are you sure you wouldn't like me to talk more about my little horses? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I, I don't know how much time we have. And hearing Arnold Schwarzenegger doing his <laughs> um, great speech from the Great Wall of China movie would be that'd just be great. That It'd would be, be really a great good. send off for the um, for the viewers. 
That would yeah. be fabulous. That would really, um, you know, tie us over for the next pod. Oh my okay. god! Um, so uh, that uh... is, I am getting, I'm getting producers doing the wrap up signal. Do we have time? Oh. Yeah. So we we don't have long. We don't um... have. We might have to save this for next week. A cliffhanger oh. special. Arnie returns. Oh, yeah. We'll mm. see if we can get you back next week if we are out of time for. Um... We're out of time for this for today. <laughs> You're the saddest a... bitch I ever met. <laughs> and you come back before we'll through. Mister, I'll make a man out of you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Uh, so, yeah, I guess we're going to wrap it up here. Um, and Arnie, do you think you'll be back next week? I will return. Nice. nice. Very nice. good. All right. We will, uh, thank you all for listening, for watching, for the donations. Very kind. Um, we will be back at the same time next week, 5 o'clock on a Friday or 1 o'clock on Spotify. Um, Bam. See you later. <laughs> Very cool. Bye-bye. Uh, <laughs> Bye-bye. Hey guys, I'm back. Did I miss anything? Uh, it's ending, oh, sorry, Simon. Say bye. Now. Say bye, Simon. Bye!